Hi you guys, so I know I've received a ton of questions about an update with the Boheme Egyptian Wave hair. Um, so I figured I would do a final review. I've actually recorded two or three videos in between um, like washes and things like that with this install but never got around to uploading or had issues uploading. So I figured I would try this one last time and make a final review since I'll be taking down the hair this week. Just so you know I've had this hair installed since October 8th. I have a net install just to kind of reiterate some of the things that I mentioned in my previous videos. Um, I have a net install. I have probably about two and a half packs of hair. I started off with the 18, um, or no, not an 18, I'm sorry, a 16 at the bottom, a 14 in the middle, and a few pieces of 12 at the top just for a layered effect so that I wouldn't have to cut so much. Um, so yeah, we'll just hop right into it. Um, just so you know, <laughs> I didn't do anything to this hair today but wash it. I had somewhere to be, so that's why it looks like really frizzy and stuff like that. But it's actually really soft. It probably just doesn't translate well on camera. But um, I just kind of used my blow dryer to kind of get it to hurry and dry and pin the front back because I had somewhere to be and didn't have time to straighten it like I typically would. Um, and I didn't want to put any product in it because I will be straightening the hair for work this week. Um, so I'm sure you guys want to know how the hair does with uh, shedding. The hair does shed. It is beauty, su beauty supply store hair, you guys. It's all, number one, all hair sheds. Number two, it's from the beauty supply store. I have not purchased a pack of hair from the beauty supply store that never shed. That's just me. Um, so if you're used to virgin hair and that, oh, I only got like one strand <laughs> when I brushed my hair today, then this isn't going to be the hair for you. But for me, I'm fine with the shedding. It's actually, if you want me to compare it to the Indie Remy Ocean Wave, it sheds a lot less than that. With the Indie Remy Ocean Wave, I almost felt that at times I had a uh, just hair following me and shedding everywhere I went. With this, it's just like when I brush it, of course, there's like hair in the brush. But other than that, no, like I'm not just sitting here tugging and it's just hair, 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 like it was with the Indie Remy Ocean Wave. As far as tangling, yes, the hair tangles. <laughs> um, mostly around the nape of the neck. This is the longest length I've ever had. I will, Boheme is really generous with the length. So although my last install was Indie Remy, the Bobby Boss, was the same I had this exact same you know lengths in my hair this is much longer um so I still would say this is the longest that, I, that I've ever had so around here it does tangle but for the most part it's nothing unbearable I don't think I would say not it's not too bad um as far as the texture of the hair goes I think this hair gets better with time but I think that about pretty much every Remy or brand of Remy that I've used I think it looks better as you wash it it's not as shiny and things like that so um the texture is it matches well with natural girls like I said I'm I'm you guys know I'm natural I don't have a perm color anything um I just will blow dry or let my hair air dry and then kind of press it out with either the pressing comb or the flat iron and it matches the texture pretty well I think um, as far as holding a curl um I'll insert some pictures somewhere in here from like uh I think if I have them if I can find them on my phone because I have a new phone um, I have some pictures of the hair curl. The hair holds a curl pretty well. I think you can go, you can, like if you were to put some tighter curls in it and then let them fall and you want to go for like that wavy look the next day, this is the perfect hair for that. Um, I also had a question about whether or not you could see the dye when you wash the hair. Um, I saw it the very first time I washed it, but after that I didn't see anything. Um... Yeah, I didn't I didn't see any brown or anything like that in the shower. Um I didn't have that problem. So as far as products go, um I will show you the products that I use for this hair and what worked for me. 
they were pretty much the same for the entire time. Um, as far as washing the hair, I used the Organics Moroccan Argan Oil Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, and as far as my leave-out, I still use the Aphigy products. But um, when I would get out, <clears throat> I would take a t-shirt to kind of cut down on the frizziness. Well, depending on how I planned on wearing it. If I wanted to wear it wavy, I would take a t-shirt today. You see it's frizzy because I dried it with a towel. <laughs> but um, if you want to cut down on frizziness, even with your hair, um, you should dry your hair with like an old t-shirt, a clean old t-shirt of course um and that cuts down on frizziness and all that so after i did that i would spray this and i'll tell you why i sprayed this effigy keratin green tea reconstructor and i use this on my hair and i start using it on the weave uh these extensions are geared towards african-american textured hair you have to take care of it that way I found that this hair was not this wasn't the type of hair that oh that hair doesn't like any product I don't think so I think it needs something to keep it moisturized that was a big deal for me um I didn't want it to be dry because when it looked dry even if it was straight no matter if it was straight or wavy if it was dry it just looked a hot mess it looked like you needed to clip the ends of the hair so I started using this on it, like I said, towards the bottom. And I also, this right here, this right here was a godsend for me. And I can't find my top, so excuse it. But this Moroccan Argan Oil, the same one and only brand that I mentioned before from Sally Beauty, was, is, not was, is excellent on this hair. It moisturize it without it weighing it down without it looking like oh she put oil on her weave it didn't look like that at all it's the argan oil uh and look at the ingredients so many people and companies are coming out with this moroccan argan oil because it's trendy make sure you look at the ingredients and make sure that it is what they market it as because if it's not it will weigh the hair down but when i'm straightening the hair i use this john frida frizzy's heat defeat I use this because it is human hair. I do like to wear the hair both wavy and straight. And with the Egyptian wave, it's not a, uh, it's not just a, it's not a deep wave. It's like a soft, loose, beachy wave. Like, it's nothing too out there. It's kind of like that bed head look, which I like. You might not, but I like it. So I don't mind wearing it like this. I went out today with it and still got a compliment. So if you don't like that kind of toss up look, then pay this no mind, <laughs> but I do. So, um, yeah, but when I do want to wear the hair straight, I don't want to worry about it not bouncing back to the, you know, original cur curl pattern or wave pattern or as small as it may seem, I still don't want it to get to the point where it's just like flat, lifeless, and straight. And that's just me. But as far as products, that, that was pretty much all I used. I didn't do much to it, but like I said, it needs the moisture. Like definitely no ifs, ands, or buts about it. And finally, like would I purchase the hair again? I don't know. I think I like the versatility. I think I like the softness of it. I really like how it feels, but I don't like the tangling. That was a big that was a big deal for me. It wasn't unbearable, but I think that I'm kind of ready to venture out and possibly try um some virgin hair just because I get so in so often. It would be really nice not to have to purchase cuz I don't reuse my hair. Um, I have before, but that's not something that I do every single time I get an install. So I would really like to have <laughs> some hair that I can just kind of use, not necessarily over and over again, but not, you know, have to break the bank every time to go pay for my install, pay for pay for my hair or, you know, different things like that. So I've looked at Indique. I've looked at uh, It's Better Than The Rest because I've seen quite a few reviews on their hair um here on youtube so i'm not quite sure what i'll do but i'm sure i'll come even if it takes forever to show you guys <laughs> what i decided to get um so like i said i'll be taking this down all in all 
it's pretty decent hair for beauty supply store hair. I like the texture. I like the versatility. I like um, that they're so generous with the length. Don't like the shedding. Don't like the tangling, which is something you're bound to get when you're purchasing hair from a beauty supply store. I'll be out on the lookout and I'll try to answer everyone's questions. If you've asked me questions I didn't answer, it's because I've been trying to upload a video or because I knew that I was going to have to record another one and I was going to try to answer all your questions or, you know, update you on the hair, which is pretty much what everybody was looking for. So, um, I've also got some questions about pricing with this hair. Um, for me, the hair range from about 114 a pack with that being the longest length down to I think it was 89.99 a pack with that being the shortest length which was the 12 inch so um and then my beauty supply offered 20 percent off of your total or of each pack of hair so um I think there are some people who order online that's not really my cup of tea as far as beauty supply store hair because the color and all of that I want to make sure that nine times out of ten I'm going to be a number two and I want to make sure that it's going to match with virgin hair I don't care because I know I'm going to have to dye it because I know it's not going to be this color so I don't want to ramble but I hope I answered everyone's questions if you if I didn't let me know and I will get back to you as soon as possible thanks bye